All right. Well, welcome back to Shaving with Fuzzy. I'm Fuzzy. Hi, y'all. So we're on night 20 on the turnaround. And as you see, not in my den. So it's okay, though. So what had happened is the last two days, I've woken up, and as soon as I roll out of bed, the phone's rang, and they needed me to come to work. So haven't had time to shave. They've been saying, don't worry about shaving. Come on in. We need you. So two days of growth at work is driving me nuts. Completely nuts. So I always keep my travel kit in the truck with me, uh, Pathfinder in this case. So uh, we're going to see if we can get in a travel shave here in the little restroom of the, the guard shack while somebody else is babysitting things out there. So in my uh, travel kit, of course, I got my Williams. And I've got the uh, 1912. Now this is a G3 model with a set. I've got the plastic sliding set. So it's uh, the Bakelite handled G3 model, but it's a 1912. And it's a, just a Jim Jr. You know, nothing, nothing amazing there. And uh, this sink does have warm water, but it doesn't have a stopper. So my uh, travel brush here, which is an Omega travel brush, by the way, bore, is uh, soaking in some water. Now this is the one, you know, what can you do? I don't really like using a cup, but when you're traveling, you do what you got to do, right? Huh? Yeah. All right. And then I always keep a aqua bevel. Now I like glass bottles. My bottles at home are glass. I refill them, but uh, for traveling, plastic bottle ain't so bad. So that's the setup. And we're gonna see how uh, how this here works. I've got a new treat blade that uh, I keep in my my travel stuff. I keep some treat blades, so I got a new treat blade in there, and we're, we're, we're gonna see what happens here. It should be all right. If anything else, it'd be better than what I got. Cause this working with a stubble like that drives supervisor fuzzy nuts. All right, we're gonna do our normal. I'm a prep a little bit of a face wipe and then we're gonna get our soap out here shake our little water out all right nice little ziplock or glad I can't remember glad container for the soap and this is just old modern Williams of course I do have a couple of shave sticks, but uh, they're another kit. So the Williams is in this kit, so that's what we'll use. All right, I'm gonna load us up some soaps. Mm -mm. BDH is good for this too, by the way. I used to keep BDH in, but anyway, here we go with some Williams. Now this water is, uh, I don't know, it's plant water. So it's been treated a lot. And I don't know exactly how it's going to do, but we'll keep some dip, just to tip the brushes in. We're trying not to make too big a mess because this is my work t shirt, so I don't mess it up too bad under my uniform. Oh, yeah, gee, we're going to load a little more soap. Sometimes when you're using different water, you got to experiment a little bit, but that's all right. We'll load a little more on there. Right into it. No problem with that. All righty. And I trust you. You may notice that this is the same razor as I call my, uh, my favorite 1912. I've got one of these that I keep on my think at home. And you'll notice, <laughs> notice the Williams still hanging around. It hasn't faded out. That's just for them anti-William folks. Ah, oh, you know, it always just disappears. Well, maybe sometimes. Not this time, it looks like. Instead of having the sink to wash the razor out in, you just crank the water on for a second. At least it's warm water. Now, it wouldn't be a real big deal if it was cold water. But I prefer warm water shades. All right. Look at that. I got to keep things moving because I uh, don't want to be away from the work for, for too long. 
you've ever worked one of these uh, positions, you'll know what I'm talking about. You don't want to be out too long. No really such thing as taking a break. All right, here we go. Now we're just going to get us a nice light, especially for the second pass. Get us a nice light. Now what I don't have is I don't carry, and I don't know why I don't, or I couldn't find, I usually carry, I couldn't find my witch hazel, so we're not going to worry about a uh, touch-up pass tonight. We're going to do everything with the with the Williams here. All right, so we'll come across. And you'll notice even the, uh, even the second coating of Williams is doing really good there. That's what we like. That's how we want to. Still a lot of slickness there. But I think what we're gonna do for a uh, for a touch up pass. Oh boy, look how good that does. That razor, William soap, new blade. <laughs> so nice. We're just gonna put us what's left in the brush here. I'm not even gonna worry about whether it sticks around or not. Still plenty of slickness there, and that's what we're gonna use for our touch up. I just even if you don't really need a third touch-up pass, I like going through and, you know, keeping a routine. So let's trim up around the goatee here. And what this means is tomorrow afternoon when I wake up, it's only going to be about a three-quarter day's growth, so we'll see. All right, going to here where we normally do a little touch-up stuff. Little draw a line in the front of here. There we go. An at-work shave with the travel kit. You can keep the shavers down. You gotta let them shave. It'll take me a few minutes to get everything cleaned up, but that's okay too, stay out of the way. That's okay too. Nothing wrong with that, is there? So you keep a travel kit around, you might want to. Just for cases where you need to, uh, you know, grab a little shave. Always nice to have around. I've done this, you know, traveling, stop in a rest area or wherever. Doesn't even really have to be a rest area. Shaved on picnic tables with bottled water. Sometimes you just gotta have a shave. So there we go. So I'm not gonna get into a rant tonight. But I'll give you a heads up. My next rant is going to be shimming razors that were never had the thick blades. You know, most people say shimming is so that you recreate the thicker blades. Now, I've seen it before, and now I've seen it again. And it's some people I like, so, you know, it's just not, not people I don't, but they're, they're shimming razors that never need it. So that's going to be the rant the next time I get to where I can have a rant because I can't do it here. But until then, y'all have a good one. I'm going to go back working on night 20 in a row. We're going to get it done. And, uh, you know, happy shaves to you.